Have you thought about selling your home recently? Have you outgrown your home and you're finally ready to upsize your living space? Or maybe your kids have moved out and you now feel that your home is too big for your current needs. Whatever your situation is, you definitely wanna watch this video because today I'm going to share with you five tips to get your home show ready to get top dollar. If we haven't met before, my name is Stacy Muller and I'm a seasoned agent in the Phoenix real estate market. No matter what the status of the real estate market is, whether it be a buyer's market, seller's market, or even a balance market, the buyer is judging your home the minute they walk through the door and oftentimes even before they walk through the door. In any given market, sellers still need to make their home shine if they expect to get top dollar. Just remember, the first impression is the only impression. If you want top dollar for your home, then you need to make a good first impression on the buyers. Think of the model homes you see at new home subdivisions. Yes, that is what you need to make your home look like. So here are five tips to get your home show ready to get top dollar when you go to sell. Tip number one, declutter. Take half the stuff out of your closets, then neatly organize what's left in there. Yes, buyers will snoop. So be sure to keep closets and cabinets clean. Remove all the extras from the kitchen and bathroom countertop that are nice to have out on a daily basis, but stuff buyers really don't wanna see. Tip number two, keep your home clean. On top of making an effort to declutter your home and make it feel inviting, it's also important to keep the house neat and clean while it is listed. Make sure you put away toys, laundry, dishes, Windex the windows and mirrors and wipe down the countertops. Also remember, not every buyer is a pet lover. So if you have pets, then make sure to put away the bowl full of dog food or the smelly kitter litter box and vacuum up the pet hair. No buyer wants to be covered in fur when they leave your home. Tip number three, always be show ready. Buyers are less likely to make an offer on your home if they aren't able to easily schedule a time to see it. If your home is available to be seen at any time, that opens up opportunities for multiple buyers to go from curious to eager. I know it's not always convenient, but if you wanna sell your home, then you need to make it accessible for when buyers want to see it. Tip number four, price it right. This one is super critical, even in a seller's market, to set your home at the right price to maximize selling potential. Pricing your home too high just because you think your home is worth more than it is is not always the best strategy. In fact, this strategy tends to hurt you as a seller. The only homes that sit on the market in a seller's market are the ones that are overpriced or underimproved. In a lot of instances, sellers are purposely priced in their home slightly lower than asking to acquire more buyer competition, which typically results in multiple offers over the asking price. And finally, tip number five, take the home out of your house. One of the most important things to do when selling your home is depersonalize it. The more personal stuff, the less potential buyers can imagine living there. It's time to put away the family photo wall, memorabilia collection, and personal keepsakes. Also, it's time to stage the rooms in your home for their intended purpose. If you've been using your dining room as a playroom, then it's time to pick up the kids' toys and put a dining room table back in that space. Or maybe you've been working from home and your kitchen table has turned into your office. It's time to remove the computer, printer, and work clutter and make it look like a kitchen table. Now that you know my five tips to get your home show ready to get top dollar, you may also be interested in finding out my top three improvements you should do to your home before putting it on the market. If you have any other questions regarding the buying or selling process in the Phoenix marketplace, please reach out. I'm a seasoned agent with 15 plus years experience and I'm here to help you with one of the biggest financial decisions you will make.